Uh, Ruff and Churro, I think. Did yeah. Ruff and Churro win doubles grands? Yeah, they won doubles okay. grands. Yep. We got Mario versus Ganon. Mm -hmm. So this should be interesting. Um, Mario actually has a lot of good tools to gimp Ganon. He does. To say nothing of the fact that he just straight up outframed him. Close. Fireballs enough to push Ganon back so he's up he won't recover. Keep his Ganon side. Say nothing of Flood. It's nothing of Flood, that's right. Yeah. Um, however, G er, Ganon does keep wanting to call him G-Man, but does still have some advantages, <laughs> such as, you know, attacks that hit in a circle, so Cape is pointless, yep. I guess. So even if you get flipped around, still gonna hit. But uh, what Ganon has is the range advantage. If he can oh, keep Mario true. out, which is really hard because Mario is a really fast character. Super floaty too. He just floats in, floats out. Yep. But he has both the range advantage and he also uh, wins all trades. Like Mario has very low damage per hit. What? Oh, you have that? I have a Okay. I'll wait till after this game. Alright. I'll see you again. Uh, let's get video. Yep. But whatever. Anyways, back into this match. G-Man takes the first off. Up there. Up there. Hits the opposite of the direction it looks like it should. But. What? How did that hit? How did that even get close to hitting? We take Mario, why? Mario's good. He's a good character. Oh, there's a blood. That's enough. Oh, the kick. The end kick. Alright. Just like that, evens up the game back at 0 0. So, this is scary for uh, that guy now, though. Ganon gets significantly better on last stock, specifically because Ganon side's an option. Yeah. Like, at other times, it, it can just not be. But here it is. Oh, I won the game no matter what. Even to the league, doesn't matter if you're winning or losing the game side. Yep. Ooh, oh my, my god. I got that, oh my but he goodness. just reacted slightly wrong. Yeah. And Mario has, you know, like frame three and it's going on top special, so. Ooh, reach the goal. Get the up smash. Not enough. Oh. But Ganon's lean is the only reason he avoided that. Yeah, he's a heavy lean though. Like most heavies, they're just huge, huge, huge. Goal. Yep, and smart by G Man there to go for the platform. He's afraid of that. Look at that. Those fireballs flood. But, ooh, well, there it is. I don't think he actually had the recovery range to make it back if he you don't think so? wasn't there. Because he'd already used his jump. Oh, oh. Okay. Alright, yeah, so that guy is up 1 0 now. 1 0. <coughs> See, are you going back to Starsville? I, don't, I, I wouldn't be too surprised. Uh, G it seems like to be one of G Man's more favorite stages. Hmm. Well, I don't know if it's actually a stage he particularly likes or if he just really hates striking. I feel like it might be more in the second. Maybe, you sure? Oh, okay. Okay, so we're going to final destination. Or, no, nope, I'm uh, blind. I yeah. definitely know where we're going. Yeah. Battlefield, this is definitely a good stage for Cannon. Um, the range on his attacks, he can pressure the platform super well. All sorts of stuff. Sure, yeah. totally. Mario has some really good stuff here too, though. Like, especially, uh, if, you, if anyone remembers Ally, or Anti, versus Zero. Oh, yeah. Zero does. Yep, you got max rage. It, it's really hard to do, but it's possible. Awesome. There. Something to be aware of. Ooh, that was close. He held that up smash a little longer, I think, pretty good. Yep, he tried to cover non tech because that's not something you can actually react to. Right. But called it wrong. And up air there does you. not care if it gets caved. Keep it all you want. So, oh, oh my god. god. Wow. That has a lot oh more reach than god. I thought. Yeah, no, it hit super far. So crazy. And honestly, even if you got the shield up, that's a shield pop. Yep. So, but only anything you can do is jump away. That was actually, like, that was really good spacing by G-Man there. Because, yeah. I, like, he rolled in, but it put him at the right spot where he was super scared. <laughs> he thought he could get back by rolling away, and just, it didn't work. Yeah, it looks oh, like... My. The anti, or the ally, sorry. Up smash, up smash. Did it work? No? Up smash. <laughs> Keep up smashing. His up smash is too good. Because Mario's up smash is super, super safe. Like it's actually really, it's really hard to punish. Like even on shield. Oh wow. Okay. That works. Close. Yep. But the know? lean so forward actually managed to cross up his shield too. Yeah. Or 
I'm not sure if he actually shield, but he managed to cross him up, mm -hmm. so the grab whiffed. Nice, so that guy evens up the stocks, but he has quite a disadvantage. Yeah. Yeah. figure out what gets some damage from the fast fireballs is good, but... And while Mario does have gimping capabilities yeah. on Ganon, unfortunately he doesn't have anything like Ganon's side, so he's he's gonna have to work for this. He's gonna have to work hard. really hard for him. And every time he's like trying to keep Ganon, all he just can... Up air. Yeah. Up and it looks like G-Man is taking something from Mars, but he decides to up smash. smash. Oh yeah. my. Nope. Ooh, okay, so that was grab. really good. Um, you can actually avoid Mar Ooh, the down it. tilt. Yep, that up smash is so lagless. Like, it, it's <laughs> actually safe enough that as sheep, I don't believe I can power shield me. Can't power shield me. Oh, yeah, that's and so it crazy. like outranges everything yeah. close. So, you know, with with the level of totally safe on shield, it is that move is. It's scary, move. yeah. It, it's fitting for Halloween. It is very it, fitting it's for very Halloween. G-Man and I were talking about that with Samus Villager and the spooky pocket charge shots. Yep. Pop shields kill at like 40%. It's crazy. Alright, so we're going to Battlefield 2. Okay. Or actually, Ooh. Battlefield 3, because Miiverse yeah. exists. This actually... In Battlefield, Mario can hit an opponent on the platform if he's like directly under him, but on this stage you can't at all. Yeah, I'm like, pretty sure Ganon still can. He still can, yeah. That's yep. really it's so. kind of interesting because uh, that guy's the one who counterpicked him. That is interesting. I wonder why. Maybe he just likes the stage because he's very good at him, maybe. Potentially. Maybe there's something I, know, I know that uh, Churro likes the stage because he can switch to Villager and hide his tree. Yeah, yeah behind the behind the flowers. Yep. It's, it's kind of dumb. It, it, it's it's, there, it's huh? weird. It's really good to with it. And it's not as dumb as like Brawl Snake uh, planting explosives on the upper platforms of Lilat. They're black. The stage oh, is black you, wow. And the camera. Wow. Angle. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Get out here. Right. <laughs> good shielder. Yep. Very patient. Realized he didn't need to do anything. But. I think G-Man could have actually gone for a second up smash uh, there and gotten it. It would have been really close though. Ooh, 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 reads wow. the ledge hop oh, nice. and okay. sticks a foot right there. <laughs> so with that, as long as he can... Um, the thing about Mario, like, the thing that you need to do against him is keep in mind, when he's at kill percent, he doesn't really have seven. He has absurdly good kill moves, like up smash. Mm -hmm. But if you can play around them and just, like, spam shield until it gets to the point where he will finally kill you with back air, or back throw, then he has a very, very difficult time killing you. Yes. Oh! oh! Inside. Nice read. So technically a two stock there. Technically two G Man coming back. Very strong. I'm gonna go play Brian. You and me? Okay. Uh, so I'll hop off. Hi.